So this is the solution to a LEC 142 problem sheet 5 on power. This is the bonus question. So the point of this is to get you thinking not only about what the value of power is, but how this actually costs money because you're electrical engineers, you're going to build things, but they're going to cost money to run. So this is to get a bit of a think about what's going on. So you're told a motor runs from an RMS current of 10 amps when supplied by a 250 volt RMS AC supply. Assuming a power factor of 0.75 lagging, that's because it's a motor so there's an inductor going on there, you're asked to find the real power of the motor for part A. For part B, find the cost of running the motor for one week continuously. This should say if one kilowatt hour of electricity costs 12.2 pence. Um, I made that correction on Vital. Please make sure you have it, otherwise it doesn't make a lot of sense. So, how do we go about solving this? Well, um, first of all, I've started by writing my important information. So, this is a motor. We know that IRMS is 10 amps. VRMS is 250 volts. The power factor is 0.75. Um, and we've said, we've told it's lagging, which means it's inductive, so the Q value is going to be positive. Um, it's not really relevant for this question, but it's worth um, including just for the sake of completeness. Um, so here we go. So we're asked to find the real power P. So you, we know that that's going to be equal to the RMS current times the RMS voltage times the power factor. So we've got all of this information in the question. So this bit's quite straightforward. So it's just 10 times 250 times 0.75, which gives you an answer of 1,875 watts. So that's part A. That was really straightforward. Um, part B we've got the additional information that one kilowatt hour of electricity costs 12.20 pence. So we're going to be running this motor continuously for one week and we've got this value in hours. So we need to find how many hours in a week. So that's one hour times 24 because there's 24 hours in the day times seven because there's seven days in the week, which will give you an answer of 168 hours. So that's how many hours our motor is going to be running for. So we need to find out how much it's going to cost us to have this going. So to summarize, we are running a motor with a power consumption of 1875 watts for 168 hours. So we take 168, because that's the number of hours, times the um, power consumption of that motor, which is 1875 watts, and then we find that we're going to use 315 kilowatt hours of electricity. So that's the first bit to get to that point. So now we know how many kilowatt hours we need to run it for this long. We can find out how much that's going to cost us. So know that one kilowatt hour costs us 12.20 pence. Times that by the total number of hours gives us a value of 3,843 pence, which if we convert, because that number's not particularly helpful, let's convert it into pounds, and we find that the cost of running the motor for a week is going to be 38 pounds and 43 pence. So hopefully that all made sense to you. Uh, if you got that far, well done, and congratulations on completing example sheet five.